Assalamu alaikum. This is Abdurrahman Uthman, a student of King Faisal University. In this video, we will continue discussing the select statement with distinct keyword and word. Again, here is the standard syntax of a select statement. We will be using the tables that were generated in lesson 16. So make sure you did that before proceeding here. Click SQL workshop, then SQL commands. Again, make sure to always set rows value to the maximum. We are ready to convert the following English statements to select statements. Number one, we will select only distinct country ID column from locations table. To understand what distinct is, let's first display all country ID columns. Select country ID from locations. Run it. We have five rows and US was repeated three times. Now let's add distinct keyword before country ID. Run it. Our rows is down to three, and all of them are distinct or unique. And number two, we will select employee ID and bonus columns from employees table where bonus is null. To understand what null is, let's first display all employee ID and bonus columns. Select employee ID, bonus from employees. Run it. Notice the dash under bonus. They are null values. Now let's display those with null bonus by adding where bonus is null. Run it. I try adding not before null. Run it. It's the opposite. Move the not to after where. Run it. Why is it still correct? Because that not represent the logical NOT operator like AND and OR. Using LIKE deals with pattern matching. The two wild characters we can use are PERCENT and UNDERSCORE. PERCENT may represent zero, one or many characters. On the other hand, UNDERSCORE represents only one character. In number three, we will select first name from employees table where first name starts with J. Since J is the first letter and anything or none may follow it, our pattern should be J percent. Select first name from employees, where first name like J percent. Right. The two names start with J. And number four, we will select first name from employees table where first name starts with J and ends with R. Therefore, our pattern here should be J percent R. Run it. Only Jennifer matched. Last, we will select first name from employees table where first name has a second letter of E. Therefore, our pattern should be underscore letter E percent. We have five rows and all of them has E as a second letter. In our next lesson, we will use order by with select. Thank you for your interest in this channel.